Hey, everybody. Two boys. One brain cell. My name's Charles Beeson. Joel Norton. And today we're going to react to some Lawrence Arms. Patreon pick. And this is Quinson Tuple Your Money off of Cocktails and Dreams. Yes. <laughs> yes, indeed. <laughs> How much is Quinson Tuplin? Five? five. Is that just five? five? I think it's five. I, I know that's what the quince means, but. Five times? Okay. I'm, I'm guessing. I'd like, like to 5x my money. That's yeah. what I call it, at least. 5x <laughs> money gives yeah. a couple extra hundred bucks, huh? <laughs> yeah, man. <laughs> <laughs> All I got is 40, guys. <laughs> oh, shit. All right, let's just jump in and see what this is about. Let's do it. Halfway point. I'm digging the sound. I am loving his vocals in this. Yeah, same. Like, a lot. Yeah, instrumentally, I'm just getting into it. Um, lyrically? <laughs> lyrically, I was like, okay, you got me interested. And then Yeah, I'm curious. Throwing a lot of random shit at me, though, as well. Four lungs on fire and four burning eyes. I never thought I'd hear a song about so covered in hair. <laughs> yeah that, that was a wild tossing uh, oh, why is the soap covered in hair well i mean just you know how soap yeah normally is. you know you, you gotta ever get once all there's a hair or two on there right I, dude, like a bar of soap yeah dude i got issues with it do you really dude if there's if there's hair on my soap it's getting washed off now ocd huh? uh-huh nice it bothers the hell out of me does hair in general gross you out hair on the in the shower yes yeah okay interesting in your food? No. That's wild. I make no sense. You, if not. there's a hair in my food, I pick it out. I don't care. But if there's a hair in my shower, do you even have problem. to trick yourself to pretend it's not yours? It's yours. No. I do that. That's what I do. Oh, I'm no. like, oh god, I'm in a restaurant. There's a hair. I'm like, yep, that was mine. That was mine. That was mine or my wife's. Oh, that was really long. It was my wife's. Didn't come near her. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's blonde. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, exactly. I'm like, oh, you know, maybe there was a hair from my daughter on my shoulder and it like got in there. You know, I gotta lie to myself straight Seriously? up. Seriously? Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, when I'm at a restaurant, if there's hair in my food, I'm like, meh. Shit happens. I mean You would. I mean, I yeah, I shouldn't have even asked about the eating aspect. I've seen you eat some wild <laughs> shit. As have they. <laughs> yeah, right. <laughs> but not back in your heyday when you were, you know, that you ate that little Caesar pizza that was out there for like two weeks. I thought you were gonna <laughs> die and he lived. Didn't even get bother him. Nope. <laughs> Anyways, this song, though, has a really nice sound, really good flow, and I'm liking his vocals so far. You just want to f- yes. finish it out, see where it goes? In the city where I used to go, but now it's covered with fences and gobs and light posts, and I'd never go back when everything was the same, but it killed me to know that it's changed. Dreams, when there's these dreams that will grow. But till they get so goddamn big that they explode. I'm way late in the smoke and it's wrong in the brain. It's grown up like them and lose us like me. What's left in this 
just really want to know you yeah. know at what point were they talking about you know money yeah not a clue me neither I had no clue how that title ties in at all <sighs> I think it's good for you personally but of course you do <laughs> <laughs> uh, not a clue bud but I don't care because I dig the song. Oh, I really dig the song. I really dig the song. Like it was just good. Like it sounded good and everything else, and a nice flow to it. Instrumentally, vocally, sounded really good. Yeah, I really like those vocals. Flowed really well with all the lyrics. Mm-hmm. I just I'm. There were definitely lyrical parts I didn't get, but I don't. Yep, hundred really percent. Don't even care. Not even mad about it. I'll care later. I'll try to figure it out. At some point. Maybe. You won't. Or I won't. You'll just jam out and I'm like, oh, cool. <laughs> it's possible. It's, it's it's probable. It's probable. There you <laughs> go. Where are you going rating-wise, Buttercup? Oh, you know, I'm going to go flat eight playlist. Damn, son. All right. I really like that. I agree, man. Like I said, I really liked the vocals and the instrumental was nice. I will say by the end, the instrumental was hoping for a little bit of a guitar solo or something just to make it a little mix up. But that's my only like nitpicky thing about the song. Um, Lyrically, there's there's stuff there I really liked. Um, It kind of reminded me, reminded me of a uh, like written wise, kind of reminded me of the Menzingers a little bit. The way there's just kind of like some random stuff that tied together kind of felt like it tied together but you weren't really sure how but it was like really in depth yeah um so it kind of i guess maybe it was the other way around the menzingers remind me of this i'm not sure um either way yeah either way vice versa but uh i'm gonna go with a 7.3 playlist boom boom so that's gonna make it into our punk list which is on spotify y'all oh so, yeah so if you want to check that out we have all our spotify playlists down in the description below and everything we've rate together over a seven or higher goes in there. Or if one of us has an eight, it automatically goes in there. Yep. So it's turned into a nice little list. So shout out to the Patreon for the pick. Hell yeah. Very solid. Um, anything else you want to add? That's all I got. I'm Joel Norton. I'm Charles Beeson. Two boys, one brain cell. Make sure you drop down in the comments on who gets that brain cell. Do it. Because we only have one. Peace out. I'm going to go quince and tuple my money. <laughs> <laughs>